my name is Rachel Russia and I'm going to show you the steps I took on how I feminized my face with Botox and um, filler. So I'm going to start with, am I like centered? Um, I'm going to start with Botox. Um, I had my entire forehead done, like the this thing, like I can still move my eyebrows just fine. But, um, oh God, my nose is so runny. I need, I need a tissue. <laughs> my crow's feet, but that's for, for upper face, relax everything, smooth and everything. And then I had my um, masseter muscles, my jaw muscles done for more of a V-line shaped face to like take weight, not as in like weight, but as in mass of my lower face. And my lower face has always been more chubby, has always been more pronounced because jaw, duh. And my lower, my upper face was very um, like, bony like not youthful not feminine god i need a tissue i don't don't pull on my hair bitch since my lower face was a lot more um heavy i decided to conjure that so i put a shit ton of filler in my forehead like in my temples 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 it's making your face more youthful it's making your face more feminine and then i also like injected here like entire my entire forehead i'm sure i have like five mils in my forehead already which is intense when you're 27 but like you gotta do what you gotta do um and my profile looks something like this now i will not show you before us because bitch is dysphoric it's not wow, but it's like something. At least that's what I like to think. And then I had some filler in my nose tip. Um, cheeks to like have this youthful chubbiness. You feel me? And that's it. I would never put filler in my lower face. I have some in my chin though. Because do you know this line? Like I'm sure all of you know this since... I mean, probably don't because you're watching my video, but like um, the nose tip and your chin, if your lips go forward, uh, like beyond this imaginary line, then it's kind of obvious that you had lip filler, but I'm half Filipina, so we got big lips, but I had an upper lip lift. That's, by the way, the second most feminizing facial feminization surgery you can have, which is a lot cheaper than the forehead, which is uh, place number one, it's like spot number one, um, because testosterone-based puberty makes your brow bone pronounced, which is not a vibe, sis. So but this space is also something that is very feminizing, and I've read like on, on blogs and such, that it is the second most feminizing procedure and since it's only like 3000 where I got it done it was more affordable than a forehead which I'm gonna do in Marbella eventually but this is just like for now since I cannot afford more for now yeah I'm poor um what else can I say um, yeah, think of proportions. Don't think of lips are feminine. Um, think of proportions. I guess that's my best advice to give you. Think holistically, don't overdo it. Um, and transitioning takes time. Transitioning takes time. If I were to show you my what I look like before transitioning with hormones. Hormones do so much. They really fucking do. But I'm not gonna sit here and say that filler and Botox didn't do shit for me. Like I actually did improve my looks with filler and Botox and that's all I can afford currently. Yeah, FFS is fucking expensive. Fuck this, honestly. And taking care of your skin, like getting laser, getting all of that shit done before transitioning, before you come out is also probably very helpful. Um, work on your voice, 
get laser done. Yeah. Work on your posture. Like something that I really learned. It's like posture thing. Okay, wait, wait, let me just. Let me just show you what I mean. No, I'm not going to get naked, but kind of. Okay, this is working. Oh, this is working perfectly. Okay, so like if I were to sit like this. My Adam's apple, broad shoulders, like, mm. So I got to sit up straight. Shoulders back to make them more petite. Wait, this is maybe a bit too nude. Um, shoulders back. Um, wait, can I, can you guys see this? Like the shoulders back, head up straight and tucked in slightly, not tucked actually, and like, see princess, work. <laughs> <laughs> I had three coffees, please, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, um, but like, you know, like sitting like this, like pronounces your, your um, whatever this is, and their deltoids, deltoids, trapeze muscle. that's like what it's called in German, um, and like, yeah, but if you go back, shoulders back, Good posture. Look instantly more feminine. Work. Love. Are you feeling it? No. <laughs> I need to stop looking at myself in the viewfinder and look at you. <laughs> I'm going to shoot myself in the head, I swear. Um, okay. Yeah, basically, now you know what I mean. Posture, posture. Um, like... Oh, another thing, another thing, which I cannot do yet because I'm fucking broke as fuck, is getting, excuse me, I thought I wanted bangs, but bitch, was a mistake. Okay. Oh, that'll do. Um, so, something that the Asian trans girls are gatekeeping from us, and I'm half, so I'm like, on both sides is that weird to say um is getting botox done to your shoulders why because it atrophies and then you have weight off mass of your shoulders literally making your bottom half more feminine did you ever wonder why those thai and filipina um trans girls always look so dainty and sweet it's because they are not sick, which helps. Um, they get Botox done to their shoulders and boom, dainty as fuck. Like even to their like biceps, it's intense. Like basically you cannot use that muscle anymore. So when you work out, it's like, I mean, who wants to be bulky? Some girls do. I take this back, but... Most trans girls want to be like cute, small, petite, and like getting Botox done there. And having good posture also helps, but it takes weight off your, like it makes you look more dainty, more feminine, I suppose. And then in return, your hips and ass and like bottom half of your body will look more because in contrast to your upper body, it looks bigger. I guess that's how you do it. The same thing I've done to my um, face. I took weight mass off my lower face and added um, weight to my top side of my top half of my face to make it more pleasing. Pleasing. Yes. Okay, that's it for my video. Are, you, are we feeling this? Do I look like a gay pirate with this? I don't know. Anywho. Um, oh my god, the, the battery is going to go off. Oh my god, I'm so scared. <laughs> okay, this is it for my video. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.